His 13-fight winning streak is no more, but Max Holloway still makes this walk here tonight as one of the best pound-for-pound -pound fighters in the world when it comes to pace, pressure, preparation, cardio. Few guys are going to be able to match with this line. And he can do it all. He's got great ability to get back up once he's taken down. He has takedown ability, but it's the range and the distance management that makes Max Holloway such a problem for everyone at 145 pounds. He doesn't seem as though he's doing 100% effort with every strike. He's just touching you. Right. But the accumulation of damage that Max Holloway will put on you will make guys just fold in front of him, as we saw with Ortega and in both Jose Aldo fights. He's a big featherweight. We have seen him compete at 155 pounds. He has said he wants to move up to welterweight huh. before his UFC and career is set. He said it, uh, he wants to beat me. Yeah, he wants a shot at the heavyweight. <laughs> Don't lose your breath. Max Holloway steps inside the octagon and is ready to fight. Daniel, as your former teammate, makes his return to competition here tonight. A lot of us felt like this moment would not materialize. He's chasing 30 and 0 now. He's chasing 30 and 0. I mean, he's one of the only guys to get out of this thing clean. Nobody goes undefeated unless your name is Habib Nurmagomedov. The guy has fought the best. He is a guy that lets you know what his intentions are, and he goes out there and he works the game plan. He's gonna get in your face. He's gonna try to overwhelm you with his wrestling. And you look at his boy, how's Bula in the corner? How Beam and Regimentoff's looking for a big night. The Dagestani social media legend has Bula Magomedov in the corner of Khabib and Magomedov tonight. Khabib and Magomedov. He has graced the octagon. It means we are ready to go with our main event of the evening. Kill the tape for this lightweight scrap. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> This is Herb fight. Dean as our referee Ready. tonight. Well, well, there is something undeniably intoxicating about this Yaz Island in Abu Dhabi, and we have got a great UFC live event for you here tonight inside the walls of the Eddie Hot Arena, which opened its doors not all that long ago in 2021. Yeah, it's, it hasn't been open long, but big moments have happened. And you can tell the excitement of the crowd every time we fight here in Abu Dhabi. It's a tremendous environment, and the fights have always looked up to the expectation. Good kicks there by Nurmako Medov. All right, early round action here on the kickbox. He's not going to win the fight by stuffing one takedown, but so far so good as far as his takedown defense is concerned. It's a great start, right, because it's something to build off of. But he has to truly understand he cannot be content with only stopping one. He's got to recognize that he's got to stop multiple over the course of this fight. Get the turn in that kick. I mean, these guys are letting it fly. What a pace that they're fighting at. Oh, nice takedown defense. Fighters separate from the clinch. 
by clinch situation here, pursued by the wrestler, and a nice job to get inside against the kickboxer, who candidly doesn't like this dirty boxing on the inside. He doesn't want to be close. He wants space. He wants things to look clean. This wrestler wants to grind on you. He wants to wear you down. He wants to make you carry his weight for as long as you're inside the octagon. It is so exhausting and fatiguing to fight this type of fight. Now he's got a good body position, yup. Pretty good head movement. He's avoiding a lot of these ground strikes. Just over three minutes to go. Postures up and lands a brutal strike to the head. All right, we'll see if he can apply pressure inside his opponent's guard here, DC. Absolutely relentless when it comes to the ground and pound. Now working the body. Nice job by Nevado Meadow. Pretty good work with the strike there from bottom position. Big ground and pound. Well, the ground and pound is there once again. Strong work here by Nurmagomedov. Oh, Man, it's almost like he's got a range finder out there. Just too easy as he connects with another good series of punches. If you're boxing this guy and only boxing him, you will be in trouble. So the Dagestani have been to take down, and this is really where he's at his best. Ground control, top control. More often than not, the opposition is unable to get that. Oh, nice. Outstanding pressure from top position here by Nermago Medov. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. That's in pretty deep. Oh, you don't see this every day. Nice adjustment. He's trying to get to the opposite side and get an arm time. Oh, gives up on the submission now. We'll see where he goes from here. Oh, he's got his knee on the belly, raining down punches here. Holloway getting absolutely worked here from the top. Let's see if there's an uptick in his urgency here as he tries to get back up. Oh, right into mount. Oh, he's got to be careful there, yep. Nicely done there as he forces the miss from his opponent. He's having his way with him here. Khabib's back in full now. Lance with the ground and pound here. Another ground and pound strike lands. Continues to attack here. We'll see if he can set up the arm ball. Ooh, that's tight. I'd be tapping. It's starting to get really tight in there. No, he's out. The fight's going to continue. Oh, my goodness. I thought it was over. I thought this fight was over. Pretty productive with the strikes here off his back. Trying to pass here, Ooh, but gets denied. Gets denied. Great job. Great recognition of seeing what your opponent was trying to do. Round two is next. Stop, stop, stop. A lot of high level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1 level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. Round two is here. Khabib Nurmagomedov versus Max Holloway. Fighter connects there. Holloway gets crushed with that hook. Single collar tie now. Shoot over the rope. 
Let's see if he can capitalize and lock up a sub. You gotta try to find whether or not you're gonna land. Ground and pound here or if you're gonna go to a submission. All right, he continues to bully his opponent here, really manhandling him on the ground. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Nurmagomedov. <clears throat> Now he's going full mount. Yep, gotta be very careful there. All right, half guard position here, DC. You have an extra pop in your step when we talk about fighters working out of this half guard. Oh, man. Khabib's going for a choke. All right, looks like that Dars is tight. Oh, come on, that's gotta be it. Well, this is exactly what you like to see. Nice combination of ground and pound punches. Outstanding pressure and activity by Nermago Metal. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do, eventually it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Lands the grounded pound strike here. Hard scramble, hard scramble. Well, he's got his back now. Marco Medov's trying to lock up on a submission now. Ooh, that rear naked choke is tight. And that will do it! He'll win it by submission. Absolutely remarkable what this fighter was able to accomplish here tonight. As you can see, the years of repetitions in the gym to set it up and ultimately get the tap there. Great technique to set up the finish. All right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. Just watch how slowly he approaches the submission, though. He never rushes. He takes his time, but it's his trickiness. It's his ability to trick people into going to the floor with him that puts them in danger and finishing fights. Let's get it to Bruce Buffer to make it official. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at two minutes, four seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by submission due to a rear naked choke, Habib the Eagle, Nirmago Meta. All right, you heard it there from Bruce Buffer. Habib Nirmago Meta, your winner by submission here tonight. This man is completely unstoppable, and he proved as much yet again tonight. Wow. He proved it again. You know, and as the career went longer, Habib did a better job of finishing people. It was not only just take him down anymore. It was take him down and submit him. We have seen him do it to the best fighters in the world. And once again, he proved when you're on the ground with the ego, you're in trouble. And the question now beckons, is there a 155-pound fighter out there that can beat Khabib Nurmagomedov?